Hey guys, this is Solrack333 with another custom review. And here I have the Studio Series uh, Revenge of the Fallen Soundwave. And uh, I originally had no interest in buying this figure. Um, but the customizer in me gave in and decided to buy it. And I'm okay with it. I mean, uh, I'm not sure how I will display it on my shelf, either in alt mode or robot mode. Um, it does come with the stand, so I'm okay with posing it like that. And I gave him a flat black base coat, or matte black base coat since they ran out of, they no longer make the flat black Krylon spray paint. So matte black, then dry brush with testers acrylic silver, and then various shades of blue for the satellite details. Then I gave it like a blue wash. But yeah, very simple repaint. I mean, there's not much to it for this version of Soundwave. I decided not to paint the stand. Kind of like how that looks. Okay, there he is. He's going to shoot Ravage. And then here is my original Revenge of the Fallen sound wave. So this is a lot more impressive. Now, since we never really got a clear shot of the satellite mode, I kind of took some liberties. I kind of made it a kind of a G1 homage by adding a lot of blues. And reds. This one I thought I would keep it straight. So there they both are together. Oops. And to transform him. Uh, just unpeg. Unpeg. Bring down, bring down, fold these up, unpeg, rotate, rotate, rotate. And kind of just hinge things into position. The head comes up and this pegs down like that. And there he is in his robot mode. And he looks cool. I mean, we never actually saw his robot mode. Revenge of the Fallen, so uh, I think this goes down. Uh, I forgot where this goes. I think it goes the other way. Whatever, it goes like that. Yeah, so we never did see his robot mode in Revenge of the Fallen. That was a waste. There he is. And after repainting him, I mean, it does look pretty cool. I mean, I like repainting the movie figures. There's a lot of detail in there to bring out. That's kind of what got me into customizing in the first place. Um, yeah. Yeah. Looks cool. And here he is next to the my old customized Revenge of the Fallen sound wave. And let's see if I can angle this a little bit better. 
and then they both are. Again, we never did see him in his robot mode in that movie, so who knows what he's really supposed to look like with his satellite form transformed into robot mode. So there they both are. And then here's the same figure unpainted. That's the G1 version. I did the hip mod to make him stand taller. And then I guess the reason I got him was to pose him next to the earth mode sound wave. So they stand about the same height. They have the same thigh detail. That's about it. Same back detail here. Wonder if it's the same joint. I think it's the same joint. Yeah. Same joint. Even has this hinge right there that that's supposed to go in. Oh, interesting why they made sound wave into a little sports car i don't know a lot of the choices in the live action movie make no sense there he is so i guess that's why i bought this so that yeah same style and then let's show off this custom This custom. And this custom. And my personal favorite. This custom. All of my custom sound waves. There's my studio series, Southwave. Thanks for watching, guys.